Not many people are, at all, aware of the Atripto Atma or unhappy spirits that are around us all the time 24 hours into 7 days. Such Atripto Atma or unhappy spirits of dead people have too many unfulfilled desires and they love to wander around and then try to attach themselves to the aura of vulnerable people and fulfill their desires through such people. Atrikto Atma or unhappy spirits of dead people, once they attach themselves to the aura of vulnerable people, use the minds of such people to fulfill all their desires. Unhappy spirits of dead people or Atrikto Atma are often jealous and cruel and use the mindset of vulnerable people to inflict emotional or physical pain on unsuspecting people. My beloved mother was mercilessly killed in 1981 by evil spirits that were channeled into her orb by black magic by one of our close female relatives who was hellbent on taking revenge on her. The most heartless maid servants with Atripto Atma or unhappy spirits attached to their aura came into our residence to inflict severe emotional pain on me and I gradually became so stressed out trying to balance my school and college education with the household chores since our maid servants never bothered to do them at all that I turned seriously sick with cancerous polycystic ovaries for 12 long years. I have witnessed the most harmless and cruel maidservants ever since my beloved mother was killed with evil energies. I have witnessed the most heartless and cruel female relatives, too, as soon as I lost my beloved mother. As I began to develop spiritually I realized that women are more vulnerable to evil and jealous Atrikto Atma or unhappy spirits of dead people. No wonder, women have killed both my parents with black magic and they are all trying their level best to destroy me in every possible manner. I have been suffering from not just the horrible effects of black magic since both my parents were killed by black magic I am being continually subjected to emotional torture by some of the most heartless mates or bands since 1981. My marriage turned into a disaster just because my ex-husband was involved with a cunning widow. Women are vulnerable targets of evil energies and hence such women are always and forever torturing me emotionally since my beloved mother died in 1981.